Time for a little update. Uh, get a little garage art done. Bit by bit. Chico Boost. Had to go back in. Uh, my machine shop didn't do a good job. Had to go in and uh, buy new cam followers and reset everything. Uh, they had everything too tight. But we're good now. Added the air raid. Waiting on a check valve from UPR. And that'll finish it. Uh, gutted the PVC or PCV uh, valve. It's getting a little turbo smoke. Not near as bad as first go around when the valves were too tight and was actually getting blowback through the valve seats. So uh, definitely follow the forward recommendations on your uh, seat clearances. So hope to have that finished pretty quick. And, and get it on the dyno. Uh, really the only upgrade this car needs is the cat back exhaust system. I'm not gonna do that right now. I'm tired of spending money on it, but uh, very curious to see what it'll do on the dyno. I think we're gonna be surprised. And then get on uh, this project and get it finished. And then I've got my selection of A, B, and C to do next. I'm not quite sure yet kind of leaning toward the old cougar hadn't been on the road in wow 32 33 years won't take much to get it on the road gonna put a five speed in it probably a 331 stroker i want to keep it old school the vet is the one that really needs to be finished up i still need to go ahead and purchase the uh, correct uh, fender side vents and uh, get rid of this uh, players on the front and then get everything fiberglassed in and it won't take a lot to get that body in excellent condition have all the 427 components machine ready to assemble uh, the Bronco really want to get back on it so we'll see it won't take much to finish yet I've got a uh, one rocker mold to put back on it and I've got some new full boards to put in it I'm gonna put it all the way across uh, get that taken care of uh, this engine was pretty tight when I took her down uh, we'll freshen it up uh, it's a really strong 302 and uh, way more than this thing needs it's kind of scary fast when it's done so really looking forward to getting all these projects completed but main thing that uh held me back was getting this bad boy out but uh, it's going to be a really cool car so keep you guys updated i'll put the dyno information on here when we get it done and we're going to take it out the track see what it'll do thanks bye